In today's Positively Georgia segment, can you imagine changing someone's life, giving them a chance to go to school, to be accepted in their community, and to eventually become successful? May sound like a lot to accomplish in one surgical procedure, but one Metro Atlanta doctor is helping do it each and every year. Hey, friend, how are you doing? Wonderful, how are you? I'm great. Are you ready? Every day, plastic surgeon Stanley Okuro changes lives. Turn to the side. But it's not what he does here at his Metro Atlanta office that makes the biggest difference. It's what he does thousands of miles away in his native Nigeria. The best gift uh, anybody can give somebody is the gift of health. And there's no better way to express that, I think. Twice a year, Dr. Okoro works with a team of other doctors on a medical mission in the country, repairing wounds, reconstructing faces, and removing tumors. What is it like to see someone coming in who has been an outcast in their community, say in their village or, you know, by other family members and shunned, and you're able to, in some cases with, you know, kind of a minor surgery, change their life completely? What is that like? It's, that's the whole thing. I mean, it makes, it does, that changes you as a person. If you can change somebody's life, I think that, for us, that's a challenge. You know, we, we can make a difference in this, this person's, this child's life. Because that child can grow up to be a president someday, you know. But if, if he or she never had the opportunity to go to school, you would never know. So it, that, it brings tears to your eyes when you see those kind of patients and you just do it. And they do it over and over again, seeing as many as 300 patients in just a week. People who've never seen a doctor, never gotten treatment, and who may have never had a chance to live a normal life. You showed me a picture of one patient who had the, um, the tumor yes. on his head. He couldn't go to school. He couldn't go to school because, you know, kids can be mean in school. So he's teased, and sometimes he's beaten up in school because, you know, people think he's a monster, you know. So, and his family, uh, some of them become an outcast in their community. So child doesn't go out. So if you change that, I mean, you put a smile on their face. <laughs> and a big smile was on his face. I yes, think. put a smile on his face, and it makes it, you feel good about yourself. You feel like you're doing something, and you are, but you feel good too. It feels good to help other people. Mm -hmm. It really does. We are blessed to be a blessing to others. I think if you don't bless others, I think that, that that's a crime. Well, part of the team that Dr. Okoro travels with heads out into the villages treating nearly 10,000 patients for those minor health issues. It's all part of an outreach program. We put a link to Dr. Okoro's website and the Medical Missions website as well. You can find them both on the Better Mornings Atlanta section. Look under links mentioned. Scroll down to Wednesday. We are back right after this break.